Welcome, Aquarius. Thank you for listening to your reading of May 4, 2023 on your Zodiac Attraction channel, where you will know what the future holds, both in money, your numbers for today, love, health, work and family. So subscribe to the channel, so you don't miss anything. Be mindful of the energy you give off today, dear Aquarius, as the Scorpio moon squares off with brooding Pluto. Though you may feel serious about your goals and ambitions, an overly stoic demeanor could rub your colleagues the wrong way. Meanwhile, Venus and Neptune square off overhead, bringing forth a hazy energy that could create disorganization. Luckily, Luna and Saturn will join forces later in the afternoon to restore order, though you'll need to slow down and ground in the present to regain control of any chaos that finds you. Plan on doing something fun or romantic tonight when Venus and Jupiter align. This is the best time to cut out the deadwood in your life. You have been sticking to a position which you no longer enjoy out of a sense of obligation or out of helplessness. You were finding it difficult to get out of this situation, but today you will be able to find the inner courage to take that final step. You will also be helped by some event in this. Is it time to bring your ideas back down to earth or should you keep pushing as far as the eye can see, Aquarius? Today it might be difficult to decide whether an idea you've been sitting on is worth hatching, or simply if it's ready to hatch or if you should sit on that egg for a little while longer. The reason for this trepidation in the stars is an intense opposition between the emotional moon, currently camped out in Scorpio and your boundless 10th house of high-minded ideals and expansion, and wounded warrior Chiron in Aries and your third house of local communities and communication. Chiron in this sector of your chart is slowly weeding out any naysayers in your social sphere, but today the moon might cast an unflattering glare on someone detracting from your brilliant notions. It might be best to keep a lid on any presentations during the morning, but the afternoon is better aspect with friendlier skies for advancement. Feel like getting away from it all? The Scorpio moon illuminates your 10th house of exploration and adventure, giving you a healthy dose of wanderlust. Could you take a day of remote work and combine it with an impromptu day trip? A short jaunt can satisfy your need for variety, especially if there are nature trails or independent boutiques, or both, near your chosen coffee shop workspace. Can't you slip away? Between tasks, research future vacations from the comfort of your office chair. You may find the perfect deal on tickets to that wishlist venue. While the moon's move to the top of your solar chart encourages a sense of order today, dear Aquarius, you may not be as sure-footed as you'd like in the first half of the day. With Venus forming a square to Neptune, situations that benefit from objectivity can be tricky. This transit temporarily makes it challenging to see others, your plans, and yourself clearly. Taking a risk or turning a blind eye to a problem can have unfavorable results under this influence, and it can be a persistent problem that returns later. Aim to invest your heart into something you have and love rather than pin your hopes on something out of reach just for now. This is not to say you shouldn't dream, but mirages are likely with this transit. Don't sell yourself short in your relationships or business, either. As the day advances, you're more optimistic, and confidence builds. An open, generous, and forthcoming approach to conversations attracts positive attention. You can be particularly pleased with your current interests and projects. Now we will tell you how it will go with money and luck, but first remember to give us a like, subscribe to the channel and activate notifications, this helps us a lot and so you never miss your daily reading. Money and Luck What do you value, Aquarius? Some illusion and confusion may surround your creative endeavors when Venus in Gemini squares Neptune in Pisces. You could feel relatively inspired, so new ideas and passion projects might be popping off. However, there might not be definitive financial or professional security associated with your endeavors due to the square. Given that the moon is in Scorpio, you may feel like it is time to invest in your career path. But you should get all the information you need before diving into new professional pursuits. As you strive to create more security in your life, the universe will ask you to clean up a bit of a financial mess from the past. An inadvertently missed payment could turn into something more, and it may take your best diplomatic efforts to get any fees waived. 
take care of business before everyone finds out. This is a day to contemplate your finances, Aquarius, and not make any hasty decisions. The moon is encouraging you to go inwards in order to reach positive decisions surrounding your finances. If you're struggling with making decisions or confused about which direction to go in, today can bring some clarity and guidance. Meditation is strongly recommended and so is walking among nature if possible as this helps to clear your mind and enables you to view things from a new perspective, Aquarius. What issues do you face right now and where are your intuition and inner wisdom guiding you at this time, SAG? Lucky Numbers Your lucky numbers for May 4th are 10, 14, 45, 26, 31, 22. Daily Love Today may give you blessings and good news, Aquarius. As sweet Venus, our goddess planet of pleasure, pirouettes in your solar fifth house of true love and passion, she'll spin like a fire dancer and blow sizzling flames over to glorious Jupiter. This is a phenomenal period to embrace light-hearted and exhilarating conversations with your sweetheart. However, you may instead decide you'd like to take a quick trip or scamper about town. If you do, it'll bring excitement and laughter to you both. Let the magic moment intoxicate you to the greatest degree. The cosmic climate today makes you feel okay one minute and crazy the next. Love is up and down, and you are not sure whether your relationship is actually on or off. As your romantic life is a little erratic, it may be best to take a break from each other for a while and do other things that will help you feel refreshed and renewed. Does your romantic partnership provide your life with meaningfulness? Does it connect you spiritually to something bigger than you, something that you believe in? These are good questions to reflect on today as the moon is in Scorpio and in your 10th house. It's so beautiful when you feel that your connection with your partner goes beyond just a physical, emotional, or even mental level. Having that sense of sacredness be a part of your partnership allows it to fulfill you on so many more levels. It is good to make sure that those you decide to commit yourself to, have similar beliefs as yours. This is not to say that you need to have identical life philosophies or agree on everything, but it definitely makes a relationship more meaningful and likely to last longer when you are able to create a life with your partner that is built on your fundamental beliefs. At work. While practical conditions are forcing you to work quite intensely today, your mind is in your home and you are more interested in spending time with your family. Hence, you need to learn to juggle both the commitments expertly. Do not ignore your work though you are sorely tempted to play hooky. You should use your lunch hour and after work hours and leisure time to balance both of them. You will be invited to social engagements and once you get there, you will be the star of the show. At first you may be hesitant to mix business with pleasure, but it will behoove you to do so. An important breakthrough will be made when you do. Do you feel spiritually connected to your job? This is a relevant theme to ponder over today as the moon is in Scorpio and in your 10th house. What are the things you can do that permit you to have a larger experience doing what you do? Larger in the sense that it connects you to something bigger than you, something you believe in, something you have faith in. Doing so allows you to experience so much more fulfillment and meaningfulness through your job. So many people are dissatisfied doing what they do, because their spiritual and professional lives are kept separate. True spirituality is a life where the sacred is expressed through all aspects of your life, including your job. Health Your health may be a little down today due to ailments related to stomach. It may buy minor. Today, take necessary precautions while drinking water and other cold beverages as they might be the cause of waterborne diseases. It is also advisable that today you stay away from unhygienic and street food as you may be vulnerable to infections. The innovative energy of today's aspect makes you feel optimistic about the future in many ways. You may be ahead of your time, however. Concentrate on the here and now. Give yourself the best possible present by tending to your physical needs. This means plenty of fresh drinking water, lots of good rest and lots of organic foods for your body. Exercise keeps you full of positive energy that gets you where you want to go. You may feel a sense of detachment or distance during this time, Aquarius. 
Prioritize self-care and engage in activities that help you feel more connected to others, such as volunteering or spending time with loved ones. Moonstone is a crystal that can help you feel more empathetic and in tune with your emotions. Eat foods that are high in iron, such as leafy greens or lentils, to support your energy levels and overall health. Family and friends. It is useless to drag a relationship for the sheer reason that you are in the relationship for a long time. Today you may feel low because of uncertainty and mental instability. Do not feel guilty. The relationship is not worth sticking to. Move on. Make up your mind today. You may move out of your relationship if you make yourself strong enough. You're easily one of the most intellectual signs of the zodiac by nature, if not the most intellectual sign, and while that's all well and good sometimes your brain takes center stage for so long you forget about other aspects of your life, certain more physical aspects, and today would certainly be one of those days due to a strong vibration overhead that might leave you thinking yourself in circles. The moon is in Scorpio and your high-minded 10th house of foreign cultures and boundless horizons, encouraging you to think as far afield as possible, but today La Luna will receive a quick yet harsh checking vibe from wounded warrior Chiron in Aries and your third house of local communities and communication. We love that you get to this part of the video, don't forget to subscribe, like it and leave us your comments, at Zodiac Attraction we always read them and see you tomorrow, have a nice day.